Hello guys. So recently I got a back on a little gun safe, a PDS-1500. So uh, recently got it and thought I would do a review on it and let y'all see uh, what it is. How to put the batteries in, set the codes, and reset things. Just uh, give you an overview of it. I've had one for years and this served me well so I got another one. I hope you enjoy it. Hello guys. So. Today we're looking at the stack on PDS-1500. I'm borrowing my wife's scissors here for a moment because I did not bring my knife. I've got a bad habit of that, so. packaged up okay here similar to the older one I bought that I'll bring out here shortly so we got an instruction packet um, keys here you get into there. They don't make it easy, do they? Alright, so let's get this look at right here, I guess. Alright, so we're going to pry this open and use our key here. And let's see what's inside. Oh, we got batteries. So we got mounting hardware to bolt it down. Little silica packets to keep everything dry. Or we'll say drier. Now we got our batteries in. All right, so there should be. I think that's our reset button. So you get to take. Let's get our key out of here. That's not gonna let me. Okay, so there's our reset button. So you push that. Beep. Let's go one, two, three, check. All right, so that should be set. So. Turner. There, so we got our safe locked key out. So one, two, three. Turn, open. If you want to reset it, push the button. We'll say one, three, four. So you can do three to eight characters or three to eight numbers. Once you do that, one, three, four, check. That opens it up. So I'm gonna reset it to one, two, three. So it's easy for me to remember whenever I get done with this video. <laughs> put this back in place for now and then I'll reset it to my own personal code. So it's got about the same space as the older one does. So for reference, I do have it open. It is unloaded. It easily fits a 9mm shield, a couple of magazines, uh, as well as you can fit 
more than one gun in there easily or even some couple additional items. Um, it's a pretty decent size. It's got a basically just two locking mechanisms on that side and it doesn't look like anything else so you have your two main locks here that go out and secure it along with your hinge so it's a uh, it's made to be bedside or drawer uh, the other one I had held up for a long period of time without any trouble I've been using it for years I just had a need to have additional uh, secured storage in other places in my house so the dimensions on this 11 and 13 sixteenths by 8 and 5 eighths by 4 and 3 eighths of an inch high. Uh, it's about 12 pounds, 13 pounds. So it's not something you lug around real easily, but it's, uh, it's movable without any trouble. So if you want it to be secure, you need to bolt it into place. And of course, keep these secure and out of the way for when the batteries run dead, like they did on my last one, uh, because I forgot to change them, as I'm always going to do occasionally. So that's it. It's a nice little uh, gun safe. I'm going to use it upstairs along with my one downstairs so that uh, I can keep my son out of uh, some of my stuff and I can keep firearms uh, in different locations uh, without having to go back to the same spot all the time. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe and go ahead and hit that bell so that you get notifications as we send out new content. Bye guys.